I'm here today going for you with the basic thing about the question some of you are asking this question here is the Wing Chun effective in a street fight? I put in the post on the community area. Oh, quite a lot of you interacted with it. Also onto the Facebook as well. Is it Wing Chun effective in a street fight? I say over and over again on this kind of thing. It depends on the person <laughs> joining, okay? Now, affected or not, I love to, you know what? I love to use it, this dummy a lot because you can feel the <clears throat> attack movement on it and the movement so you can able to do the thing that you need to do on it. And the most important thing is to be used into the training side a lot into the Wing Chun is the hammer fist. Hammer fist is very good. You know why it's good? Because they're attacking in a certain part on the face like this, okay? On the front, on here. Then using this part to attack. That way, you not damage your hand. Especially in the street to be used. You don't want to damage your hand while you're punching like this. You mess up your hand, it's gonna be a nightmare. So, for movement and technique, good to use in technique that not damage your hand. Let's go back to the question about is it Wing Chun effective? And some of you comment underneath this video here and tell me what you think as well. I want you to get involved with this and then we're gonna talk a little bit about it. And then if you've got any question, I'm gonna make another video and talk more about that. Effective or not, it individually trying and their mindset. Into the street, so many things you need to consider about. You got to think about the awareness of what is it around. You have to think about the, when you're training, you wear the certain clothes you wear. It's very different the way you wear the clothes when you go outside, okay? And the terrain you're in, okay? Outside, it has so many things out there. It's very dangerous. And if you're doing the movement and you're not aware at all, you're going to be in a big, big shit. Because when that time comes, you don't know what's happening. It's so many chaos gonna happen. So is it effective or not? It's go back to individual. But if you're gonna use in the movement on it, a lot of time to be used and make movement effective and get things done, is straight away attacking into the vulnerable spot. Okay, run the neck to get rid of them. Okay, when you find this movement straight away, you got a problem with somebody in the street and you got a problem with them. Sometimes you engage with a certain uh, uh, problem with certain people. They start they're talking, you see their eyes start to rolling, they start getting angry, their fists getting crunching, start to ready to eat you up and they start to grab hold of you. You want to chew you up and spit you out and that is where you need to be aware very quickly. Backing off for a bit, keeping a good distance and get yourself ready, okay? It's all about preparing. If you're not ready and when the time comes, they're coming fast. That's why surprise, speed and violent action. They surprise you, they're coming in, bam, 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 coming in, okay? They're coming with loads and loads of force coming in. So they're coming very fast with the speed and then they're going to use all sort of movement like bang, bang, punching, grabbing, all sort of things they're uh, dealing with you. And you have to realize in the street, a lot of time they don't play fair, okay? Anything go, you can smack your nut here, smack to the face, you grab the hand, ah, the finger like straight to the eye here, ah, rip it off and they're going to using that. I said, man, this is going to be look nice onto the, my wall for the trophy. Because people are not really there. And especially when you have too many twin, it's a nightmare. When you have too many twin, then you're going out there and when you get involved with fighting, and that's where the big problem is, okay? So the most important thing to understand, effective or not, is individual person, how they're trained. And the most important thing you need to understand this three basic rule, know yourself. Second rule need to understand it, know your enemy, who you're dealing with. And the third rule is know your surrounding. This is very important. Without knowing yourselves out, you're confident enough to willing all the movement you're doing, all the technique you're learning, all this basic movement here that you feel strong, you feel confident, okay? And when that time comes, it's gonna be a nightmare. 
know your enemy. You need to understand who you're dealing with. If you see the guy and you're big ugly person there and tattoo everywhere and he's already angry already and pissed already and you argue with them they're gonna tear you up beat the fucking living tail out of you and that's gonna be a nightmare okay and the surrounding where are you are you in a safe area or are you in a violent area if you are in a violent area Man, you're not gonna come home alive. So, this is the basic rule. Comment underneath this video here. We have a little bit of interactive here and talk about it and discuss about it, okay? And then how we're gonna go through this um, uh, training. If you want to ask more questions, comment here and I will be here to answer the question for you. And this is the important thing. In our community area, onto the um, uh, YouTube as well, they have loads and loads of comment about it. I, try to interact with you not a bit because it's all about learning interactive with it and understanding and if you like this kind of stuff here and you answer the question you like to hear a bit more and want to know more about this sort of thing then watching this video here about movement onto the hand basic movement here to get your arm and body in line okay and then if you like that watching it and then otherwise keep watching keep learning and keep practice all the movement you're learning otherwise i will see you onto the Next lesson, Maswong here and out.